Okay, so Crazy Chef, we're back. And today we're making oxtail wellington. If you've seen the Jamaican stuffed dumplings with the brown stew chicken, you should be excited about the oxtail wellington. Crazy Chef, big vibe. We're making oxtail wellington. And if that's not a vibe, I'm not a vibe, right? If that's not a vibe, I'm not a vibe. Oxtail Wellington. Like if you've had beef Wellington, if, if you're seen what a beef Wellington is, you'd be as excited as I am about this beautiful oxtail Wellington. Right? And if you've been a part of my channel, you know I know how to make some oxtail. Right? First thing I'm gonna do is season my oxtail. I put that uh, dry rub and because I'm making a Wellington without a doubt I want to get a crispy sear so it's not burnt it's a crispy sear crazy chef big vibe big vibe some peppers some scallions a little bit of shallots and some garlic and we're gonna mix that in and then what we're gonna do at the end so you stick around for the end of the the video the oxtail section of it and you'll see how i substitute the mushroom deluxe part of my oxtail wellington crazy chef you know the deal big vibe yeah i'm gonna take my potatoes and i'm gonna put it in my blender because we're not using a mushroom config that's what you put in a beef wellington this is oxtail wellington so we need something to substitute that so we're gonna use our potatoes onions and peppers and then we're gonna puree so we're gonna put all these garlics and stuff in there too then we're gonna just puree all that and that's what we're gonna use crazy chef big vibe like share subscribe for the vibe you know we try to make a difference on this channel so that's all we got we're gonna puree and then we flour and I'm gonna put two ounces of As soon as our dough looks like uh, breadcrumbs, we're gonna just add some ice cold water, a little bit at a time. You don't wanna break the dough, you wanna just keep it nice and just let your dough come together. Crazy chef. Crazy Chef, big vibe. If you like this video, so far, you haven't even seen the end result yet, but you made it here one way or the other. Hit that red subscribe button. Just imagine having some uh, oxtail wellington. That's a vibe. That's a vibe of dough. Dip it in water. Just put it right on there. Why I dip it in water is uh, 
I want to make sure it holds on to it. Now that's it. If you ever had beef wellington, right? And if you ever had oxtail, you can imagine how delicious these would be when I make my little oxtail wellington. For my top, I just want to give it a little vibe, just like that. Crazy Chef, the biggest vibe. The biggest vibe, the Oxtail Wellington. Crazy Chef, big vibe, big, big vibe. I want to say, to get such a beautiful, beautiful plate, it takes skills, right? So it takes skills to get such a beautiful, beautiful plate like this. And it takes a vibe. You know, look at that. Look at that. Look at that presentation. Beautiful. Beautiful. This is my Oxdale Wellington. Crazy chef. Big vibe. You know the deal. You know the vibe. You know the type of energy it takes to come up with these beautiful. As always, we have to mess up the presentation because we got to show you what's on the inside of the oxtail wellington. Listen to that. See that? Beautiful crust. So, 
All we gotta do now is we gotta cut it. We gotta cut in there. Look at that crust. Beautiful. Beautiful crust. Right, so we cut in there and we expose our Wellington. Look at that. So we cut in there and we expose our Wellington. Look at that tender oxtail, look at that. That's some good oxtail, look. Right off the bone. So, if you're worried about how you're gonna eat it, right? It comes right off the bone. Right off the bone. So, let's just put this guy here. Cause I wanna take another photo when it's open. So we'll put that guy there and we'll maybe put this here so it looks nice, right? Look at me making a presentation in my presentation. Oxtail Wellington. Biggest type of ad. Biggest type of ad.